move over EVs, robot axis, and cars morphing into computers. The hottest buzz in the automotive realm is the Subaru S transformation of virtually every vehicle type, from cars to trucks to SUVs. In the realm of family SUVs alone, Honda boasts its Trail Sport trim, Toyota flaunts its TRD off-road, Kia presents the X-Pro, Hyundai showcases the XRT, and Nissan offers the Rock Creek. The competition among ruggedized crossovers is so fierce that Subaru has even rolled out a new wilderness trim to uphold its status as the reigning king of plastic cladding. Pros All-terrain tires offer excellent performance on various terrains. Confident power delivery Embraces the Subaru aesthetic without compromising on style. Cons Roof rack produces considerable noise. Limited rear seat and cargo space. Complex infotainment system it's another testament to the current trends that Mazda, once known for claiming that every model possessed the soul of a sports car, is now venturing into off-road territory with the 2024 Mazda CX-52.5 Turbo Meridian Edition. Launched shortly after the original Mazda CX-50 hit the market in 2022, the Meridian Edition follows the typical blueprint of a compact crossover tailored for those who have a wardrobe filled with Patagonia Better sweaters. For an additional $2,800, Mazda will adorn the vehicle with a distinctive hood sticker, silver accents on the rocker panels, and unique 18-inch wheels fitted with Falcon Wild Peak A-T Trail all-terrain tires at each corner. Available in Zircon Sand Metallic or Polymetal Gray Metallic, the interior boasts terracotta leather seats that exude luxury, almost justifying the added expense on their own. Mazda's optional $1,235 Apex package further enhances the rugged theme with splash guards, black lug nuts, and a pallet-style roof rack that might challenge most owners to secure anything for a smooth 70 miles per hour ride. Despite the deafening noise the rack generates at highway speeds, its true utility lies in providing a valid excuse to shout, I can't hear you, whenever a passenger complains. Depending on your family dynamics, that might just be worth it. Tire selection can make or break the experience. Choosing the right set of all-terrain tires is crucial, as demonstrated by the contrasting examples of the CX-50 and Honda's Passport Trail Sport and Pilot Trail Sport. While the CX-50 maintains its likable demeanor, the Honda SUVs serve as stark reminders of how an off-road package can compromise everyday performance, akin to navigating a Walmart parking lot on Black Friday. The Honda models suffer from unstable steering and a soft ride, meandering on the road like a child chasing bubbles. In contrast, the CX-50 Meridian Edition sets a benchmark for emulation. Equipped with Falcon all-terrain tires, it retains Mazda's hallmark steering precision. These tires even alleviate the excessive steering effort found in other CX-50 variants, offering a more natural feel compared to its predecessors and the larger CX-90. However, there's room for improvement in tire compliance, as the suspension impacts still feel overly firm and noisy. Note, Mazda has implemented steering and suspension adjustments in CX-50s manufactured after December 2023, but our 2024 model predates these updates. Although the Falcon Wild Peaks aren't flawless, they deliver commendable performance. While the Meridian's cornering grip and figure-eight lap times slightly decline compared to its predecessors, the difference may go unnoticed by most drivers. Notably, braking distance remains unaffected by the all-terrain tires, with the Meridian stopping impressively from 60 miles per hour in just 115 feet, outperforming its premium plus counterpart by 2 feet. However, the brake pedal's gradual descent during emergency braking instills less confidence, resembling a loss of hydraulic pressure in the lines. Still true to its CX-50 roots. Beyond just the tires, the Meridian Edition relies on the same all-wheel drive system and off-road driving mode that comes standard on every CX-50, enabling it to explore beyond the beaten path. With its low roofline, Mazda's soft rotor boasts elongated and sleek proportions, giving the impression of sitting close to the ground. Despite this appearance, its 8.5 inches of ground clearance are typical for a compact crossover, though ironically, the Meridian Edition sits 0.1 inch lower than other CX-50 turbos equipped with 20-inch wheels. While the Meridian Edition may surprise you with its off-road capabilities on trails, it's important to recognize when you've ventured beyond its intended environment. 
designed to effortlessly navigate sandy tracks, snowy mountain passes, and rocky fire roads leading to trailheads. The Falcon tires provide traction in muddy conditions and protection against sharp stones. However, this CX-50 lacks the clearance, articulation, and underbody shielding necessary for serious off-roading, a common trait among similar crossovers. In the urban environment where most Meridian models will spend their time, the CX-50 delivers confident acceleration without flaunting its speed. Mazda has finally tuned the 256-horsepower 2.5-liter turbocharged four-cylinder engine for immediate responsiveness, offering impressive real-world performance. With a 0 to 60 miles per hour time of 6.7 seconds, just 0.1 second behind the Premium Plus variant, the Meridian Edition combines brisk acceleration with precise steering and excellent body control, making it more enjoyable to drive than many compact crossovers equipped with standard road-going all-season tires. The typical CX-50 concerns. The Meridian Edition shares the primary drawbacks of its CX-50 siblings. Despite Mazda tailoring this compact crossover specifically for American consumers, it appears to have overlooked our preference for sizable vehicles. Rear seat space and cargo capacity fall noticeably short compared to competitors like the Honda CR-V or Toyota RAV4, prompting parents to meticulously assess the fit of car seats and strollers before committing to a CX-50. Another weak point is Mazda's infotainment system. While the concept of a control knob instead of a touchscreen is appealing, BMW's iDrive has effectively utilized this method for years, Mazda's implementation struggles with software organization. Engaging in anything beyond basic tasks entails navigating a convoluted maze of menus, lacking the intuitive ease of use desired by buyers. Obtaining the aesthetic for a fraction of the cost, trade-offs. Viewing off-road package-equipped crossovers as mere money-making ventures is tempting. It's hard to justify the Meridian Edition's $2,800 premium when the sole mechanical enhancement is a tire upgrade. However, if you regard these off-road variants as fashion statements akin to sporting Patagonia or Cotopaxi gear at a local brewery, the $43,860 price tag feels more reasonable. In a world where screens dominate our lives and work follows us everywhere, it's no surprise that Americans seek escapism, even during their daily commutes. The Meridian Edition enhances the CX-50's capability on loose terrain marginally, but its true appeal lies in its superb on-road performance. While there are areas for improvement in the CX-50, compared to its Subaru-inspired counterparts and other compact crossovers with all-terrain packages, the 2024 Mazda CX-52.5 Turbo Meridian Edition delivers compelling value and exceptional 